organized hockey was probably four years old, around there, four or five. Um, I know I started skating around like three, and it was definitely my dad, because he played at Michigan State. Um, he was a goaltender, so I was picking up a stick when I was like just a couple months old. Would always play ball hockey. Uh, our basement was unfinished, so I'd go rollerblade around there for hours. So it was definitely my dad who got me into hockey, though. Being close to Bowling Green, I was able to come down for games even before I committed here. First day I got here, I fell in love with it. Like the campus is beautiful. The games are a great experience for a fan or a player. Brandon's a kid who, you know, has, has come to Bowling Green and, and done everything we've asked him to do as a, as a person. He does a great job in the classroom, is in a, in a difficult business program, and obviously a, an assistant captain for us. So he's highly respected by his peers and his coaches. And I think one of our players last year put it best and said, you know, nobody loves Bowling Green more than Cruiser. You know, like skating with the Falcons, like after hockey games or doing autograph sessions, it really showed me how big this program is to the community of Bowling Green and then the university as a whole. You know, wasn't really expecting anything crazy. If it got drafted, cool. If not, I was gonna keep working, hopefully go to an NHL development camp. Buffalo Wild Wings was having a buy one, get one deal that day. And so we're like, oh, okay, like, might as well just go watch the draft there. It's gonna be on. One of our like close friends actually got drafted the pick before me. So I was like mid text to him, like congratulating him. And we were about to leave and then I saw my name pop up on the screen and I didn't get like a phone call or text or anything yet. So I kind of just like looked around and like Cam started hugging me, but I was like, don't want to celebrate too soon, I guess, because I didn't know if they like messed up or anything. Very good offensive instincts um, and, you know, an elusive guy and um, someone that can really uh, be a dynamic player. But it sure it makes me feel good that when a guy that we really like is a Bowling Green player, we don't have to work on his personality at all. He's a good guy. And that's, you know, we really emphasize that in this organization. It was nice being able to be at home because I just drove home and got to celebrate with my friends and family and just um, kind of broke down in tears for a little bit, especially you could see in my parents' eyes. I'm happy for them too because they've made so many sacrifices. Like I wouldn't be where I am today and I wouldn't have gotten drafted without them. It was kind of cool, Ryan Carpenter, who played at Boeing Green, texted me, congratulated me and just asked, I need any help or any questions along the way, so I thought that was pretty cool. Yeah, it was definitely probably one of my favorite experiences I've ever had in my entire life. Seeing all the support from fans, you know, going to the union, that experience was definitely unique. It wasn't a ton of people in the building, but there was definitely a lot of orange and brown, and that really showed how much support we had. And scoring that goal was one of the biggest goals I've scored in my career. And when I celebrated, I kind of celebrated to our side. Cracks does have Brandon Cruz coming wide, centering pass. There's Johnson in the middle. Now for Brandon Cruz, he scores! So I looked up and I saw like all the like friends, family, fans, and I thought that was just really special. That was, I'll definitely have that locked in my memory forever. Pure excitement. Um, I don't remember finding my family in the crowd, but I knew they were there and I knew how special it was for him and that being his alma mater. and. It means a lot to me and my family because I grew up a Michigan State fan for my dad and to, to score on them was very emotional and it was a really proud moment for myself and my family. Behind Alex Barber to seal it in. Brandon Cruz has a right wing shoot, scores! Brandon Cruz, that's his 100th career point! Yeah, when, when it went in I was, I didn't really know what to do. I kind of just like threw my arms in the air and then just went down, but um, it was definitely emotional. And if you're gonna get Point one hundred in a game like that with a crowd like that in under that kind of situation. Scoring that goal the way he did it had to be awesome for him. Just to do it when it happened was pretty special. Just like a sellout crowd, celebrating our seniors, you know, the rich history of this program. Um, just for it to all come together, I, I couldn't ask for anything better, honestly. My scholarship means a lot to me. I think it reflects a lot of the work that I've put in both academically and 
athletically in my life and it's given me so many opportunities and opening so many doors uh, for myself and my family.